If we can start to understand anger, and we can start to realize that there's something going on down deep in our mind that's producing the anger. It's really the ego's anger. It's not ours. We must be identified with the ego. We must be feeling its emotions if we're so angry. Anger cannot occur unless you believe that you have been attacked, that your attack is justified in return, and that you are in no way responsible for it. Given these three wholly irrational premises, the equally irrational conclusion that a brother is worthy of attack rather than love must follow. If you're going to continue to hold on to these three irrational unconscious premises, you're going to project this irrationality, this angry hatred and insanity, you're going to project this onto the dream characters. You are not responsible for the error. You are responsible for accepting the correction for the error. Say it one more time. You, the Christ, are not responsible for the error, but you are responsible for accepting the correction for the error. That's what miracles are. That's what forgiveness is all about. Don't blame your neighbor. Don't blame your father, your mother, your sister, your brother. Don't blame anything of time and space if you're feeling upset. Give it to the Holy Spirit.